One, I want to thank all of you for coming out tonight. I really appreciate you taking some time to come out, help support me. That's the only way I can get my message out and get elected. Most of all, I want to thank a few people here who have done really the hard work. I'm just kind of the guy who shows up, tries to be prepared for these things. But Loretta Ferraro, my wife, is a campaign manager, maybe getting a new profession. I don't know if you want that profession, but she's done a phenomenal job because a lot of you know her more than you may even know me. So Loretta's been a catalyst here in this community, being on the social committee. I know Maureen uh, was, was like that. We met Maureen. We've met no, many of you in very wise, different ways. So I want to thank you. Vicki, uh, behind me, here, has been, uh, this woman has worked very hard. I want to thank her for writing a wonderful letter in the Desert Sun yes. about me. Yes. I, I really Great appreciate work. that. And, Thank you so much for doing that, and I appreciate your camaraderie and friendship for that. And, and then another guy who's been the sign man of all kinds, uh, Clive. Clive. Yay. 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 He's done a great job of getting signs out, and most of them stay up. They don't get pulled by the city. Uh, there's been, this is an incredible story, I won't get into it, but this whole deal of signage here in the city, and how far the setbacks have to be. And some of them, you'd have to put the sign inside somebody's house to make the setback. I, I really don't get it. I really still don't get it. And the city telling me it could cause an accident. I said, really? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe if you don't like it, you want to run over it. But anyway, uh, again, we're getting near the end here. Um, if you can send out emails or things to your friends, let them know. It's really the only way I can get the word out. I've done some mailers. I've told many of you. I really haven't gone door to door a lot for a lot of reasons. I kind of like these kind of settings better. It's hard to go door to door today. Some people are frightened if you even knock on the door, let alone answer it. And quite frankly, I will not go to a gated community, even though I was told I could have access, but I refuse to do that because I think people who live there, if they want to invite me over, that's fine. I'm not going to come on invited. Okay? So. I didn't know you had this many friends. I have a few friends. <laughs> And Doty, who has been very kind as our host here tonight to put out some great food, and hopefully we're going to stay on for dinner for those of you who can. So I want to thank her. She's been wonderful to us. And we appreciate it. Kevin, too. And her husband, Kevin. And for those who live in the Montalena neighborhood, a new neighbor, okay? And we have a few here. So with that, I think I'm going to end. If you have any questions, I'm here. And I hope if there's anything that I can bring to this city is hopefully try to bring us together and, be, and work on more positive things. And if people disagree, maybe we can disagree in a positive fashion rather than to throw stones and rocks at each other. There are ways to be professional about our disagreements. Hopefully we can bring that on. Hopefully I can help do that. And I hope to provide some leadership to do that. I do represent everybody. So those are you know, polarized by a personality on one side or the other. I'm not, okay? I look at everybody the same. You have to work with everybody. I'm telling you, we all like some people better than others to work with. <laughs> it is just a fact of life, okay? But it is also life. It is what makes life what it is. And hopefully that's what's going to strengthen us and bring us back together here and work on the issues that are really important here in Indian Wells because we've spent far too much time working on personality differences and things that are kind of at a low level rather than I think of things that are a higher, more meaningful level that will benefit all of you. So that's it for me. That's the end of the speech. Enjoy it. Thank you. Thank you.